Oh God, come to my assistance. Lord, make haste to help me. Gloria Patria, Filio et Spiritui Santo. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. Alleluia. Unto the world a pleasant dawn brings tidings of the sun's first rays. It makes all things begin to shine and nature with its hues arrays. Thou art the blazing sun who burn in every age of Christ our light. To thee we turn and sing thy praise, in thee exult and take delight. Thou art the Father's knowledge true, his word through whom all things we see, in wondrous order shining forth, they draw our hearts and mind to thee. Grant us to walk as sons of light. Unwearied may we thus proceed, so that the Father's gift of grace may shine in every righteous deed. Let honest words flow from our lips, sincerity in us abound. Awaken us to sweeter joys, that only in the truth are found. To thee, O Christ, most kindly King, and to the Father glory be. Praise to the Spirit, Paraclete, in every age eternally. Amen. The man whose deeds are blameless and whose heart is pure will climb the mountain of the Lord. The Lord's is the earth and its fullness, the world and all its people. It is he who set it on the seas, on the waters he made it firm. Who shall climb the mountain of the Lord, who shall stand in his holy place, the man with clean hands and pure heart? Who desires not worthless things? Who has not sworn so as to deceive his neighbor? He shall receive blessings from the Lord and reward from the God who saves him. Such are the men who seek him Seek the face of the God of Jacob. O gates, lift high your heads, grow higher ancient doors. Let him enter the King of glory. Who is the King of glory? The Lord, the mighty, the valiant, the Lord, the valiant in war. O gates, lift high your heads, grow higher ancient doors. Let him enter the King of glory. Who is he, the King of glory? He, the Lord of armies, He is the King of glory. 
Gloria Patria et Filio et Spiritui Sancto Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum Amen The man whose deeds are blameless and whose heart is pure will climb the mountain of the Lord. Praise the Eternal King in all your deeds. Blessed be God who lives forever, because his kingdom lasts for all ages. For he scourges and then has mercy, he casts down to the depths of the nether world. And he brings up from the great abyss No one can escape his hand Praise him, you Israelites, before the Gentiles For though he has scattered you among them He has shown you his greatness even there Exalt him before every living being Because he is the Lord our God Our Father and God forever He scourged you for your iniquities But will again have mercy on you all he will gather you from all the Gentiles among whom you have been scattered. When you turn back to him with all your heart to do what is right before him, then he will turn back to you and no longer hide his face from you. So now consider what he has done for you and praise him with full voice. Bless the Lord of righteousness and exalt the King of the ages. In the land of my exile I praise him and show his power and majesty to a sinful nation. Turn back, you sinners, do the right before him. Perhaps he may look with favor upon you and show you mercy. As for me, I exalt my God, and my spirit rejoices in the King of heaven. Let all men speak of his majesty and sing his praises in Jerusalem. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. Sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. Praise the Eternal King in all your deeds. The loyal heart must praise the Lord. 
Ring out your joy to the Lord, O oh you just, for praise is fitting for loyal hearts. Give thanks to the Lord upon the heart, with a ten-stringed lute, sing him songs. Oh, sing him a song that is new. Play loudly with all your skill. For the word of the Lord is faithful, and all his works to be trusted. The Lord loves justice and right and fills the earth with his love. By his word the heavens were made, by the breath of his mouth all the stars. He collects the waves of the ocean, he stores up the depths of the sea. Let all the earth fear the Lord, all who live in the world revere him. He spoke and it came to be. He commanded it spring into being. He frustrates the designs of the nations. He defeats the plans of the peoples. His own designs shall stand forever the plans of his heart from age to age. They are happy whose God is the Lord, the people he has chosen as his own. From the heavens the Lord looks forth, he sees all the children of men. From the place where he dwells he gazes on all the dwellers on the earth. He who shapes the hearts of them all, and considers all their deeds. A king is not saved by his army, nor a warrior preserved by his strength. A vain hope for safety is the horse, despite its power it cannot save. The Lord looks on those who revere him, on those who hope in his love, to rescue their souls from death, to keep them alive in famine. Our soul is waiting for the Lord, the Lord is our help and our shield. In him do our hearts find joy, we trust in his holy name. May your love be upon us, O Lord, as we place all our hope in you. Gloria Patria et Filio, et Spiritui Sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper, et in secula seculorum. Amen. The loyal heart must praise the Lord. It is now the hour for you to wake from sleep. The night is far spent, the day draws near. Let us cast off deeds of darkness and put on the armor of light. Let us live honorably as in daylight. My God stands by me. All my trust is in Him. My God stands by me. All my trust is in Him. I find refuge in Him, and I am truly free. 
All my trust is in Him. Gloria Patri et Filio et Spiritui Sancto. My God stands by me. All my trust is in Him. God has raised up for us a mighty Savior, as He promised through the words of His holy prophets. Blessed be the Lord, the God of Israel. He has come to His people and set them free. He has raised up for us a mighty Savior, born of the house of His servant David. Through his holy prophets he promised of old that he would save us from our enemies, from the hands of all who hate us. He promised to show mercy to our fathers and to remember his holy covenant. This was the oath he swore to our father Abraham to set us free from the hands of our enemies, free to worship him without fear. Holy and righteous in His sight, all the days of our life. You, my child, shall be called the prophet of the Most High, for you will go before the Lord to prepare His way, to give His people knowledge of salvation by the forgiveness of their sins. In the tender compassion of our God, the dawn from on high shall break upon us. To shine on those who dwell in darkness and the shadow of death, and to guide our feet into the way of peace. Gloria patria et filio et spiritui sancto, sicut erat in principio et nunc et semper et in secula seculorum. Amen. God has raised up for us a mighty Savior. As he promised through the words of his holy prophets. Almighty King, through baptism you conferred on us a royal priesthood. Inspire us to offer you a continual sacrifice of praise. Help us to keep your commandments. That through the power of the Holy Spirit we may live in you and you in us. Give us your eternal wisdom to be with us today and to guide us. May our companions today be free of sorrow and filled with joy. Our Father who art in heaven. Hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. God, our Father. Hear our morning prayer, and let the radiance of your love scatter the gloom of our hearts. The light of heaven's love has restored us to life. Free us from the desires that belong to darkness. We ask this through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Amen. May the Lord bless us, protect us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Pray for us, O Holy Mother of God. That we may be made worthy of the promises of Christ.